What's up guys, Matt here. I'm here today with a super quick video. As you just saw in that previous clip, my Volkswagen Golf R was not unlocking with the touch unlock like it should. And the reason for that is because my key fob is running low on batteries and the car is not detecting it when I walk up to the car. It was still allowing me to unlock it with the buttons. However, it was then giving me a warning screen saying that I needed to replace the batteries. And of course, me being a little bit lazy, I did have a previous key fob run out of batteries and I just simply swapped out my key fob for my second set. And now the second one is also running low on batteries. So unfortunately, now we have to change them both. First thing you need to do, you gotta pick up some 2032 coin batteries. These are Energizer, they ran me about $7. And uh, get this open, get these open, and slap them in there. So I'll show you how to do that real quick. All right, so after struggling to get these out, got a little thicker on the back, remove that. And what you're gonna to wanna to do is flip the key out on your key fob and there's a little door on the back side of the key fob that is going to pop off. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is hold the key fob from this little chrome ring on the bottom and then apply some upward force on the top of this little plate. Pry like that, it pops right open. So at this point you can see the battery. There are two little tabs that are holding it in place. If you press it down and kind of get it wedged out, it will release very easily. So then with the energizer and all the writing up, you're gonna wanna put it down with this end in first and push it in place under those tabs and there you go. Pop the cover right back on and we've got one done. Now let's do it again on this side. So open this up, you've got the cover here. Pop it off. Push this down and push it in that way, it'll pop out. Same thing. Pop it back in place and you're good to go. That wasn't too painful. If you do have any questions on how to do that, maybe you have a different model key, have some questions, let me know in the comment section below. If you did find this helpful, give the video a like. It really helps the channel out. If you're new here, consider subscribing to the channel. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.